everybody, this is Tambiot, and I'm back with another Transformers video review. This time I have Titans Returns Voyager Class Octane. Uh, and as you can see, uh, we have the figure here um, inside the box, uh, along with you can see his uh, some artwork here, and uh, basically just the head connecting to the body. And you come on the side and you can see uh, some more of that artwork. Then on this side we have the Decepticon Meteor, another Decepticon Meteor. Uh, warning labels. And come to the back and we got a little bit more here. So you can see uh, Octane in his, in his robot mode, then the tanker mode and his jet mode. Uh, it says that uh, his Titan Master uh, can convert in one step and he uh, can pilot. Oh, weird. So the gun actually looks like... Oh, he has two guns. Okay. Okay. Alright, so this is actually a, a reuse. Um, well, he looks familiar because he uh, they use this mold for Optimus also. Uh, Optimus did come first, but uh, I think that this is like uh, like Megatron and Blitzwing, that this is what uh, this mold was was meant for. Um, so, hey, uh, let's um, go ahead and get this guy open so we can check him out. Alright, I'm back and we have Octane here out of the packaging and in his robot mode. This is the mode that he comes in inside the box. Uh, he does come with two accessories. He comes with a, a new gun. Um, so it's new for this and then he comes with this, uh, uh, this turret gun. And you can take and you can tab this Either way, uh, I do like this new gun. This new gun is nice. So I'm glad it doesn't have the turret gimmick in it either. So it's a nice, nice gun. So. All right, and um, you know what? I kind of agree with uh, what somebody else put up, and. Uh, I think I'll probably do this too. Let's see if this arm is tabbed in right. Yeah, looks like it. Um, I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I have to. I have to figure it out um, through the review. But as of right now, it looks like. Um, I don't know. I don't. I don't know about these shoulders. I. I think I might like them down. Um, I haven't done it yet. Because uh, I've just taken him out of the box. I haven't even transformed him. Because I'm I'm pretty familiar with how to transform him from uh, the Laser Prime figure. So uh, pretty much uh, looks like. Oh well, let's go into uh, uh, what's also in the box. His instructions and his uh, his art card, along with uh, his uh, technical data. Uh, his highest ability is a ten. So. All right, so um, yeah, let's go ahead and get this straight like that. And uh, once again, the button for this gimmick right here, um, the side fin gimmick is right here in the chest. It is uh, molded differently, so it doesn't have that grate. And then this is molded differently. These inserts are a little bit different, and then the wings are different from the uh, from the prime. So, and then the faceplate is different. So, those are your main differences. All right, so let's go ahead and transform him, or get into transformation. So we'll go a little bit different. Um, then what we did last time with uh, with Prime, we went from robot to jet to tanker back to robot. So this time we'll go robot to tanker to jet and then back to robot. So uh, first step what we need to do is uh, to go ahead and um, undo this. And so for tanker, um, Where do we want to start first? Uh, let's go ahead and start with uh, uh, removing this guy. Push these down. These clip and stay in. Oh, here's here's the uh, 
the head, if anybody's curious. He does have red eyes underneath there. And uh, Titan Masters, no paint, uh, but the head was molded in purple. All right, so um, go ahead and move these up for right now, kind of get them out of the way, and we'll work on the cap first. So, one, two, push in the fist. Push in the fist. This is going to twist, and you'll take and notch that into there. You'll see that there's a little tab and a notch. Everything seems to be a little bit tighter with this guy because a lot of these pieces are painted. So, take this, flip this around. Oh, dude, it's already scratched. <laughs> uh, that's paint scratch on there. Something rubbed up against it. Uh, one of these white pieces, I assume. Okay, and then we're going to take and rotate. Oh, first of all, what we need to do is pull this out and make sure it's all the way out and flip this like this. Ah, come on. Oh, I didn't mean to pull it all the way out. we got to push it all the way back in. Uh, when you have it pulled all the way out, it gets kind of stuck there. So you have to force it. There you go. Force it down until it unlocks. That's weird. This one goes all the way down, huh? Oh, no, sorry. Like, like that. Let me close this up. Just got to get above here and then into, into here. Well, this looks like this is going to be a little bit more tricky than Optimus. Hopefully not. Okay, good. Gosh, the only thing you have is that. I might be able to scrape that off, but it rubbed up against something. Um, we want to take um, take these these hips, and we want to push these up. There we go. All right. So now that those are pushed up all the way. Um, it looks like we're going to have to take and just rotate these around like this. I think that's it. This is going to come down. Is that right? Um, if you didn't get that, I apologize. <laughs> um, I was trying to figure it out myself, and it seemed to have just kind of slipped past me. Um, dude, that's crazy. Okay, so uh, first of all, what you're going to need to do is you see that there's some notches in the wings, and those will tab into these pieces right here. Uh, first, what you need to do is you got to push them out to the side so that you can flip under the uh, the heel or the foot. And then once that's done, you can take and kind of line these up so that it'll tab in. And we don't have issues with um, um, what do you call it with. Uh, uh, joints on this one so they can just butt right up next to each other and you shouldn't have any kind of uh, any kind of issues with uh, With them trying to come apart So that should be 
good. Flip this forward. Flip this forward. This one's a little bit easier to transform than that off on this. Flip this up. That. Hopefully that doesn't get in the way. A lot of paint chipping on this. This is the first transformation, so I got a lot of paint chipping from this part up here because a lot of this is painted and a lot of this is painted white. So. All right, so Titan Master, he's going to go in here, and you can see you can see a lot better in here. And there's there's two two holes, and just depending on which one he is depends on which way he faces or which which. Uh, vehicle mode he is in. Um, so if he's in trucker mode he's going to be like this. If he's in airplane mode then he's going to be the other way around. Alright so for um, for the truck basically the uh, weapons are going to just store on the sides here. Like that, and there's Octane in his vehicle mode. So that wasn't too bad. Um, it was a little bit different uh, with the wings, but the wings actually make it easier. And the wings are a little bit longer, so uh, they stick out a little bit uh, in the back, and then they stick out here. Yeah, no, they don't scrape the ground. You can't really see it from where I'm at, but they they don't. Alright, so uh, let's go ahead and get him into his uh, airplane mode. So what we'll do first is we're going to break this open again. Bring this open and then we need to take the wings out. So we'll bring this up like this. That's out of the way, and then we need to flip out the front fuselage or the cockpit portion. Oh gosh, this is all painted. Unnecessary amounts of paint. I don't know why they didn't mold this into into that because you're going to get paint chipping, and this is a dark color underneath. I mean, I never noticed all that detail on the inside. It's actually, it looks like the inside of a jet. That would have been cool if there would have been like a cockpit portion in here and stuff, so. But no one. Probably if they wanted to, they probably could have turned this into the, uh, the cockpit for the Titan Master. They just would have needed a, uh, um, something to go in here and you could just push them in there. If they would have used a little bit more engineering. Come on. Well, you know what? Let's do this first. Let's flip this around. Dude, this does not work. Okay, there it goes. Close this back up. There we go. Alright, so that, like that. And then basically what you want to do is you want to split the cab up here. Split it in two and bring it down to the side, kind of like it's its arms. Man, so because of all that paint that's in there, it's not allowing it to uh, sit up next to the uh, <laughs> to the fuselage. So, um, yeah, it sticks out a little bit. Like this you'll bring up. This you bring up. This will get pushed in. 
And um, so for the wings, um, you bring this these down. Uh, so basically, what you want to do is you need to get them on the other side. Um, no, like this. So you got to flip the wing under. Um, you want this to stay like this because this is going to be up. There, like that. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and do that again. So this will flip up. It'll go like this. You flip this up and then under. There. This will open up. Oh, hey, some paint on the tail. That's nice. Alright, so we have that. Uh, Titan Master, he's facing backwards now. So you just take him out. Turn him around, and you can put it back down like that. Uh, you can take this gun and uh, do like that. Um, or you can have them in here to the sides. Or if you wanted to, like I did with Prime, you can actually flip open the fist huh <laughs> his wings were a little bit different so it looks a little different on this guy so it probably doesn't work as well huh. so, yeah. all right so here's octane and he's in his uh, his jet mode I like these wings a little bit better. I um, I like how they have this their swoop back and stuff, um, kind of like a, a real wing. Uh, I think they should be a little bit further up, but <clears throat> and I can see that this could possibly be a problem right here. These stickers. Use paint here, but then they use stickers here. Man, I wish they would stop using these stickers. So, to bring him back into his jet mode. Jet mode. He's in his jet mode. Bring him back into his robot mode. I'm going to flip this down. And we want to take these wings and we want to bring them up. Um, so, <clears throat> the first move you're going to do is you're going to take and bring them up here. Next, you'll do is take them and bend them around like that. Now they're all the way up to the top. So you want to bring these out a little bit, rotate it around. Rotate around like that, then bring it out, and you're back up to here. <clears throat> Alright, I don't know if you saw that or not, so I'm sorry. So the wings, uh, if, if you couldn't see that, um, the wing was in this configuration right here. So we want to bring him up to this configuration. So first of all, we we'll bring this up, take the wing, fold it up like this, rotate it around, and then bring it back down like this. And then you fold it all the way up, like that. All right, so now uh, what we want to do is we want to undo this portion right here, bring this down, the shell portion, down on the side of the legs. We'll bring the arms back down. Split the legs. Rotate in the cockpit. I'd be very careful with this right here because I, I feel like you'd be able to scratch that cockpit really easily. Flip off the foot. Out the foot. All right. 
and bring the hips forward. Flip out the fist. The fist is painted. So like this. And we'll take this, pull it out, and you'll hear a click. There it goes. You want to split the uh, the tail fin. Split the tail fin. Oh, it's all painted. It's painted gray. Huh. Okay. And flip that down. Kind of get it out of the way. Alright, so where'd the Titan Master go? Oh, he's still back here. Um. Come on out. You gotta form the head, bro. Uh, okay, so now we got the Titan Master. Fold him up. And. Goes back up here. Okay, good. Cool. Um. I don't know. I, uh. I don't know which one I like the most. I, I think I think I do like it like this without this uh, this portion popped up. Um, yeah, I always like this down. That I don't like the way that looks. Other than on a handful of figures. Okay. Cool. Yeah. So I'm digging the colors. I'm not digging all the paint everywhere because it's messing with the transformation. It's a little too thick. Um, it's messing with uh, with this being able to tab in, and it seems to be scratching. Um, like it scratched on the hood right here. So I don't know where that happened. I don't know if it happened on here that I did that, but I don't know. It's causing issues with transformation. You can see how this is pushed in and this one's pushed out. I can't push it in because that piece is filled with basically with paint. So I have to go in there and chip it out. And I don't want to do that. <clears throat> Alright, so for our articulation, here we have the ball joint of the Titan Master as the uh, the neck. Uh, you can left and right, a little bit of up and down. Uh, you got two basic joints for your. Uh, for your shoulder here. I'm sorry, I'm moving the, uh, the wings out of the way so that I can show off the shoulder joint. So you got. Ooh, that. That causes issues with. Uh, with movement. So I don't know if. I think what I also saw is I saw somebody do this. Yeah, that's a little bit better. There we go. So now it's not hindered. Now my wings are all messed up. Okay. Let's move this up. Move the wings out of the way. Hey, at least these wings don't fall off like they do on Blitzwing. Um, so you got back, you have forward, then you have a secondary joint in here. Uh, let you move it out. Then you have your um, your hip, your arm rotation right here. Your elbow. There's nothing in with the with the wrist. Uh, there's just a um, um, a joint in there that allows you to flip in his arm or his yeah his hand. Um, so there we go for that. Uh, you come down here to the legs. Uh, you don't have any waist articulation. You come to the hips forward, back, another joint out to the side. You got your twist, and then you have your elbow, or knee, not elbow. Um, come down here to the foot. There's a little bit of some movement down here. And that's it. So, yeah, uh, this isn't one of my 
favorite characters, but I do like this one better than Blitzwing right now. Um, and this figure is way better than the original Octane that we got for, uh, for like Classics Octane. Um, now for Blitzwing, that last Blitzwing that we had that had uh, issues with the shoulder joints, I'm going to have to say that that's better than this one. Uh, I was able, actually able to uh, go in there and fix his shoulder joints um, by doing some sanding and, and such. And I fixed them with this one. I don't know if I can fix this guy. Oh well. Uh, well, that's going to do it for Octane. Uh, thanks for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, please do. This has been Tambiota. See you guys next time.